Light My Fire Campfire, PSA for those among us who may not be aware, but Eddie Vedder sang with the remaining Doors at their Rock and Roll Hall of Fame induction, which is of course a cross between induction and lactation. It was a very strange night, but anyways, some great videos to check out there, and I thought this would be a nice segue, but before anyone's fire gets lit, I would like to take just a moment to thank Mr. Savio Porto and MW for signing up for the Patreon. Patreon supporter of the Cause Club, Savio and MW, thank you for your support. And if you would like to find out what kind of fun is being had over there, the link of course will be in the description. If you're planning on playing along with the Doors album version, you will need to detune your guitar one half step down. That means instead of Eddie 8 Dynamite Goodbye Eddie, you will have E flat, A flat, D flat, G flat, B flat, and E flat. If you don't know how to get there, I've made a video on how to get there, and you will find that link in the description as well. And if you don't care about that, then don't bother. This is a campfire version, but it's not for the faint of heart. The Doors used like every single chord in this song, starting with, for the intro, G, D, F, B flat, starting on the A string, one, three, three, three. Followed by, you've gone through all this trouble to make this shape, let's move it up to 6 and 8, that's an E flat. And then A flat, or G sharp, that's the other major bar chord shape, starting on the E string, 4, 6, 6, 5. And then regular old, thank goodness, A. So, G. in there for an A7. I like the E string 3rd fret, or you could make regular A7 by opening up the G string. But I feel like there might be some out there who don't buy it that those are the chords. It doesn't quite stand without the piano tinklies. Luckily, I'm licensed to carry a kazoo. <laughs> In all seriousness, one of my favorite chord changes is when you're on a major chord and you switch to the minor chord of the same letter and that's exactly what happens in Light My Fire. Coming out of the intro, we're on the A major. And the verse is A minor, F sharp minor. And that's the whole verse. sharp minor, two, four, four. The chorus is G, A, D, give it a pinky for D suspended four, followed by G, A, D, and then it's B. You could play B the way we played B flat, but one fret higher. But since B7 is musically interchangeable in this context, and it's an open chord, let's play that. A2, D1, G2, and E2, my favorite open chord to boot. And the third line is G, D, E. So, G, A, D. G, A, D, B. G, D, E. Then, of course, you repeat the verse and the chorus just the same followed by the four and a half minute jam of just A minor and B minor. If your campfire attendees don't appreciate your commitment to Doors authenticity, I suggest you show them the way out. But if you're fixing to make a jam out of it, somebody should use the A minor pentatonic scale. That's five, eight, five, seven, five, seven, five, seven, five, eight, five, eight noodle around with that. And here's a little zen sort of bass line thing to mimic the keyboard. You can play the root, the minor third, and the fifth from each of those two chords. Put your pinky finger on E5, that's A. Put your middle finger on A3, that is A's minor third, or C. And then put your pointer finger on the D string second fret, that's the fifth, E. Notice my fingers walk. 
and do the exact same thing two frets higher for B's triad. The last screamy verse is the same as all the other verses, A minor and F sharp minor. might want to strum it a little bit harder. And the last chorus is different. It's going to be just G, A, D, twice, followed by four of F, C, D. That was the fourth one for pretend. And then you do the intro again, and then you're done. That's it for Light My Fire Campfire. Thank you so much for being here for that one. I hope that was fun and helpful, and I will see you next time with more stuff. Goodbye.